My name is Sabrina Isaac Berry, and I consider myself the god of mathematics. For me, a donut and a coffee mug are the same. I call this topology. I don't know if you saw Lecture 10, but go watch it if you have it. haven't. So in Lecture number 10 of topology, we were doing the polygon identification of um, a torus. A torus. And let us um, summarize. So it looks more, it looks like this. And it's equated with AB, A inverse, B inverse. Kind of like the equation we're going to use today. And this is our torus. So a projective plane symbol look like an R with two legs and the P squared. My oh, goodness. I go to write it anyway, even though I already wrote the symbol. Okay. Now, um, Let's start. This time we're going to use a different type of square. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, ladies and gentlemen. We all, we only have a regular equation, no inverses. A, B, A, B. <laughs> now make, make fun of this equation, that's all you want. Because it's not that complicated. It only goes like clockwise. So we so assume this is A and B again. We make the line. We rotate this. This becomes this. Don't forget the points. And then this this goes this. And then this is the same direction. And then this is the same direction if you rotate it. And then final point, and then if you r rotate it and then back, it becomes the same direction. Oh my goodness. So it has no twist. No twist at all. Go ahead, make fun of this equation. But this is your projective plane equation.